In this video, I'll show you how to use a USB hub with your iPhone 16, 16 Pro and Pro Max. This way you can connect many devices at the same time on your iPhone. So let's get started. First of all is one that is using the USB type C cable and one over here that has USB type A. If you get this one, you'll need an adapter and uh, that adapter is the USB type A to USB type C. I'll put links in the description if you want to get these. This one over here is already USB type C. So if you have one of these, you simply need to connect it to your iPhone like that. Now, some adapters will be able to charge your iPhone at the same time as you're using the different USB devices. This one over here is made by Mini Soporu and it's actually able to charge your phone at the same time. You see through this USB Type-C port, but not all of them are able to. Now, next step is to connect your devices. And obviously, depending what you're trying to connect, here I have a hard drive SSD hard drive that is connecting us using a USB type A. Well, I'll need an adapter and then I'll connect it to my dock. If you're using a spinning hard drive, it may require power. I mean, not it may, it for sure will need power and your iPhone will not be able to provide the power to your spinning hard drive. If you have one, this is not one of them. So you'll need to connect your power, your USB hub to a power outlet. You need to have one of those. So it uh, gives power to the hard drive and the iPhone at the same time. Okay, now I have connected one of these devices. If you have multiple ones, go ahead, connect them. Here I have a USB drive that is USB type C. So I'll connect it here like that. And I also have a card reader, micro SD, that I'll connect as well. Okay, perfect. Once you have connected your devices to the USB hub, take your iPhone and depending what you have connected, the example, these memory drives over there, you'll need to go into the file files app of your iPhone. The file app should look like this one over there. Once you tap on this, you can go back and when you go into the browse menu, you should see here all the devices that have been connected. Obviously, not all formats are accepted. I'll put on the screen right now which formats the iPhone is actually able to read. But if they are, we're going to see them here. So you have on my iPhone, which is the internal memory and you have the other stuff. This one is not formatted. It's not formatted the way the iPhone could read it. So you don't see it. You only see this hard drive. Go ahead, click on your hard drive. You're going to see what's inside. And from here, you can do many things. If you want to copy the content of your hard drive on your internal memory of your iPhone, click the three dots, select, select whatever folder files that you want to transfer, then you're going to click over here, the three dots down below. Copy to items. Go back. Go on on my iPhone. Tap anywhere on the screen where it's blank. Paste. And the content has been transferred. You can also connect wired keyboards to your USB hub, wired mouse, and many other different things. Once you're done, you just need to disconnect without having to go in any settings. It's not like on a Mac where you have to go and disconnect it manually before pulling the plug. So this is it. This is how you use a USB hub with your iPhone 16, 16 Pro and Pro Plus. If you have any other tricks regarding how to connect this, please leave a comment down below. If it worked, leave a comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.